Do you want to build more certainty into yourself and therefore into your life? Well, today I'm going to share three key tips with you. And if you stay until the end, I'll give you an extra key as well that I've learned from my experience. So like in my life, I've built certainty in certain areas. And there's also what do we mean by certainty? We're talking about like the belief you've got in something or mainly and most importantly in yourself. So like I've had areas when I've been really certain and we all have certainty in things. It's like we build a certainty that we can get in a car and drive it when we've driven it over and over again or riding a bike, right? Um, I built certainty in my ability to go out and deliver a podcast, right? That's something I've built. And I didn't have that certainty right at the beginning. I built my certainty that I can interact and engage and socialize with many, many different people, right? Now, this, and I used to be really shy and quiet and had no certainty in that at all. Now, I decided to talk about this because I was talking to uh, someone selling the other day, and I work in sales myself as well. So I'm always interested. I'm always looking at different styles and things like that. And I was talking to a really well intentioned guy, and he said, I'll answer your questions. Great, amazing. Jumped on the call with him, and he was a great guy, like I said, um, you know. A lot of love and respect for him. He did answer my questions, help me to my decision to join up. Yet, I probably wouldn't have if I talk, didn't talk to the second person. And he was just telling me a little bit about the features and benefits. It's not really what I wanted. He wasn't completely engaging what I was asking. Um, and there wasn't a degree of certainty in his voice. And he wasn't sure about what he was promoting. And I was put off by that. Fortunately, it was, well, fortunately for them uh, and me, because I'm joining, um, it's for an influencer I highly admire and I've joined the program and it's going to enhance my learning and my life as a result. I know that. And then I talked to the second person and she was absolutely full of certain. She's like, yep, yeah, absolutely. She was genuine as well that I always admire. She cared, you know, he cared, but, you know, could tell the heart levels caring that she had. Uh, she could relate a lot to more, more to my situations. I was like, yeah. And that's an example of when certainty really helps. And I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm signing up after this conversation. Right. And I've had it in like when I have started off with my coaching, I didn't have that certainty and people wouldn't sign up. But when I built my results and my confidence, I then started to build that certainty. And this doesn't just mean in a sales or entrepreneurial or business perspective, but it, it, it applies to life, right? Certainty, because we're always interacting with people. So it's so important we do this. And yeah, like I said, I've met as a result. Certainty in my life has presented so many opportunities uh, when I've been certain, like even when I, and by the way, it doesn't mean you're always right with certainty, yet people will buy into you a lot more if you're certain. Now, obviously, have some kind of basis or evidence for your, your thought process. It's OK to be wrong, though. It is OK to be wrong. Yet certainty, having certainty in yourself, the way you carry yourself is going to build a real, real high level of progress. And like I say, um, I've been guilty of it, of not having the certainty uh, in personal, professional environments and also having it and seeing results as well. Now, how is it helping you by being like, yeah, um, I guess I, whether it's a job, yeah, I, I guess I'd um, be suitable for this job. Um, or I guess I'd be okay with this business. No, people switched off. You're gone, right? You need to be certain. And I'm going to give you some tips around this, of course. Now, I've been guilty of the same as well. Like I used to be really hesitant, shy, and I wouldn't go anywhere for my career. When I started reading, learning, and applying, the most important thing, that's when I started growing my career. That's when I started growing my business. It's just about acting in a new way whilst doing the psychological work at the same time as well. So here is three key points for you, three keys on how to build certainty. Act and collate evidence. And what I mean by that is when you start taking action, you're not going to change things unless you take some kind of actions, even if they're small, if they're small. And start keeping a log. I like to keep it on Google Keep, keep it on a Word doc of when actually you've acted with certainty and got results. Because the more you can show the results you've got in your life, no matter how small, whether it's passing an exam, your driving test, 
uh, making a new friend or uh, starting a business, that can show you actually you've got a lot of evidence to show how great you are. And when our brain is wired to keep us alive and it looks at the negatives. So therefore, if you can build a list of things you can be certain about, then keep referring to it. That's going to build certainty as well as continue your acts. The second one, change your physiology. If you're slump, you've got your shoulders down. If you're watching this, you can see how I'm acting right now. But just imagine if you're listening, I've got my shoulders slumped. So I've got my head down and I'm like, yeah, I'm really certain of myself. No, like you can't you can't express certainty in a bad physiology. Now, one great exercise that I've referenced many times is the Wonder Woman pose or Superman pose. Hands on the hips, standing up and put a smile on your face. Do that for two to three minutes a day because that will build a high level of confidence in your physiology and then change your chemistry with inside yourself and therefore you feel more certain. You can do that before you go into a situation when you need a high level of certainty as well, like a sales call or a business meeting or a meeting at work. So the third one or even a date, right? And then the third one, visualize results in advance and celebrate. So start thinking about the, your brain doesn't know the difference between fake and reality sometimes. And when you start visualizing and seeing something and then living it again and again and again, your brain will actually think it's happened and therefore it will be more confident and make sure you celebrate. Well, celebrate can go across all of these because that's going to reinforce your nervous system to do more of it, but make sure you celebrate yourself, your results that you've gotten them already, because that will build an even higher level of certainty. Okay. My bonus point for you today is, uh, it's a strange one, but, I found it really effective. And that's to do breath work. Why do we want to do breath work? Breath work can present many different ways. And I suggest looking up uh, somatic breath work. That's really, really powerful. And what that does is it allows you to release some of the negatives that are stored in your body. So when you can release some of the stuff that's not serving you, you can start becoming more connected with yourself, therefore developing a better relationship with yourself and therefore more room for the positive. Now, not every time you do it, you get you're going to release everything yet it can be a really powerful tool for releasing some of the stuff that's not serving you that's trapped in your body but you can look up more about that just type in that somatic breath work um and there's also an instagram page uh, that they've got which is amazing as well um, i'm not an affiliate or sponsor uh, or i'm not an affiliate and they're not sponsoring me it's just awesome it's changed my life so that's what i got for you today three keys on well three plus and a bonus keys on building more certainty i appreciate you for being here you're improving other people's lives for being the best you and remember you are in control of your own self-esteem and confidence